Llama 3.1 is absolutely insane and free for AI SEO. I'm going to show you exactly how to generate AI content as fast as you can think for free. I'll also show you how it can outperform GPT-4 and Claude without spending a dime. You also learn how to create your own AI assistant that runs on your phone. And Llama 3.1 just came out. This is brand new. This is game changing. And if you want to save hours on content creation, this is probably the best AI SEO content tool you can use. It's completely free. Let me break down how to use it plus my best SEO prompts today. All right, so this is Llama 3.1. It's a free AI SEO model that you can use to generate content and do all sorts of crazy stuff with it, which I'll show you in a minute and I'll give you the prompts and workflows. Now, if you're not aware of what Llama is, this is basically like Meta, aka Facebook's version of ChatGPT or any sort of AI model. And the new version has been released this week. So 3.1 new model has been released this week. If you scroll down here, you can see the different types of models. So you can see there's a 405B, which means four or five billion parameters, 70B and 8B, right? Now you can run this model offline locally if you want to, and I'll come on to that in a minute, but you can also access this for free online. Now, if you want to run the fastest model, AKA the flagship foundation model, you would run this online, right? You would find a host that's already got it. Because as far as I'm aware, and I'm not a techie person, it'd be too powerful to run offline on your own laptop. You can see some examples of what you can do, and it's pretty crazy. You can see that it generates images. And one of the things that blew me away about this model is just how rapid and fast it actually is in generating responses. I'll show you exactly how it compares to ChatGPT versus Llama and Claude in a minute. Plus the content it creates is very sentient. You can also make your own assistant, right? So some people have been using this to generate their own AI assistant that they can run on their phones. More on that in a minute. And then if you're wondering, okay, is it actually as good as say ChatGPT or something like that? You can see the benchmarks right here, right? So this is Llama versus Gemma or versus GPT and versus Claude Sonnet. So Llama 3.1 is completely free, whereas Claude, I'm already paying for it and GPTO, I'm already paying for it, right? And so in many ways, Llama actually outperforms or performs at a very similar level to GPT-4 and Claude Sonnet, but it's completely free. And I'll show you many different ways you can access this model for free online instantly wherever you are. The other crazy thing that I've heard is that some people can jailbreak this offline, this model. So when you run it locally, it can be uncensored as an AI. I've never heard of that before, but basically the GigaChat Mark Zuckerberg has made this open source. So let's get into it. My favorite way to access this model is directly on grok.com. Now, this is one of the fastest ways to run it, which is on grog.com. You can just go on there. As you can see, we zoom in right here. You can choose the model in the top right. Now, by default, it's on Llama 3.8b. We're going to change that to Llama 3.1 insert. Now, you can see there's a couple of different versions of this on grog.com. Again, this is completely free to access. I'm not paying for this tool. And if we go on Llama 3.18b, this is a high speed instant response model. Now you can also see that you can generate voice responses right here, but I'm gonna go with the normal prompting method for now, and then I'll show you the voice in a second. So for example, let's put in this prompt right here, which you'll get access to at the end of the video. We're gonna put, for example, write an SEO article. Title is what is SEO for content creation, do this, and then I've given it some tips, right? Now we're gonna hit enter like so. And you can see that was literally instant, right? That was real time. I haven't edited, right? If we type in, for example, answer me, you can see how quick this is. It just answers it straight away. It's literally instant. I've never seen an AI model work as quickly as that. Now, why is that important? Because it's going to save you time. Every single time you click a button or wait for a response from ChatGPT or Claude or any other model, you are losing time. With this method, you are saving time and it's completely free. Right. And if we actually look at the content itself, it's not bad at all. I wouldn't say it's perfect, but it's not bad at all. So for example, how does SEO work? SEO is a complex process, but I'll break it down in simple terms. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. All right. And then it shows you exactly what to do and how to do it. Right. It's nicely formatted. It's got the headings, it's got the bullet points, answers a few FAQs at the bottom. And in terms of content generation, it generated that in, it generated 600 words in less than a second. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. All with one prompt, which I'll give you access to at the end of the video. 
Now what we can do is actually compare Claude, which is genuinely my favorite model for writing content, versus Grok, and we'll do the same with ChatGPT in a minute. If we give it exactly the same prompt, now I'm gonna to switch to Llama 3.1. We'll take exactly the same prompt, go back to Grok, choose Llama 3.1 verse style, and we'll compare the response from Claude versus the response from Grok, right? Uh, I'm gonna give Claude a head start and we'll see how these models perform. So we'll click enter here and we'll click enter here. Now you can see that already Grok has generated the whole article as you can see right here. And so Grok is literally so much faster than Claude. If we compare the actual content and the output, the content is not bad here, but I wouldn't say it's as sentient, aka as humanized as Claude, right? So for example, Claude says, what is SEO? SEO equals search engine optimization. Sounds fancy, right? But it's not rocket science. Pretty nice introduction there, if you ask me. Most copywriters are not going to be that. If you look at the response from Llama 3.1, what is SEO? Are you tired of throwing money at your website without seeing any results? Do you feel like you're shouting into the void, hoping someone will hear you? You're not alone. I've been there too. And it's a bit more professional sounding, less humanized, less conversational, but still it would pass. Now, if we do the same test with ChatGPT, and we'll go with ChatGPT 4.0, we'll plug it in. Obviously, it's a lot slower to run than Llama 3.1. But if we compare the outputs, so for example, ChatGPT says SEO stands for search engine optimization. It's all about making your website more attractive to search engines like Google. Think of it like a game of hide and seek. You want your website to be the first one found when someone searches for something related to your business. I would say the content is on par, but this model over here is completely free for you to access and it generates content as fast. So in terms of the actual quality, I would say they're pretty much on par, right? Basically the same. But Llama 3.1 is faster and you don't pay for it, whereas ChatGPT is slower and of course it comes with a paid subscription. Now there's a few more ways that you can access Llama 3.1. As you can see right here, you can actually go into your settings in Perplexity Pro if you're on a pro account. And then in the AI model section, you can select Llama 3.1405B, which is the most powerful model. You can also go to po.com, select Llama in a new chat, and then choose to use it right there. But there is a limit, right? So, so you can see the limits here. You only get like six messages available, which is not ideal. You can even run it on a playground like setting, as you can see right here. And I'll include the link inside the SP, which means that you can select the maximum minimum amount of tokens, the temperature, and you can kind of just like open AI's playground. You can tweak the dials a bit more, get a bit more control over the outputs. And that's available at replicate.com. So if we hit run over here, you can see it's generating, and I haven't paid for this model at all. You would probably only use this model if you want to get a bit more customization over the tool in terms of the actual output, how it's created, temperature, etc. Now there's also Meta AI available in the US, which you can get free access to as well. So if you go to meta.ai and then you can generate images using Meta as well. And you can see that you can preview using Meta 3.1. Now with Meta, you can actually use this feature called Imagine Yourself, take pictures of yourself, and then Meta AI can generate AI images of you. So you can see right here. Now, obviously for SEOs, the main use case is going to be for content creation, for topical maps, etc. But you can see how you could actually generate these images to either insert inside a personal branded blog or even to insert on YouTube videos if you're doing YouTube AI SEO. Made a video about that the other day. Check out my channel. And if you want to see some examples of how this can be used, you can see people are running Llama 3.1 with ChatGPT locally on your laptop, and that's free to use as well. You can also see how some people are actually turning into their own personal phone system, which is pretty crazy. And because of the speed of the responses, it's probably going to beat most of the AI models that you get as an assistant on your phone. And you can even build your own chatbots, as you can see right here, pretty crazy stuff. Another cool thing that you can do as well, if we switch back to Llama 3.1 Instant, is we can click right here and give it voice notes, and then it should reply instantly. So if I say, for example, what are three ways to generate content with Llama 3.1? 
you can see it responds pretty well. It understood my English accent. And you can see it gives us a bunch of ideas right there pretty much instantly. It's kind of like a little assistant where you can just send it voice notes and then it responds instantly. Pretty crazy stuff. And if you're using this inside Grok, you can click on the settings right here and then you can choose bullets, expand, sentence, and then the tone, right? So for example, let's say you generate some content, you want to see what it's going to look like if it was more friendly or neutral. You can select between the different tones right there. And you can also choose on expand if you want to generate more content on the same topic for your ask. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to get free access to all the prompts that I've talked about today, check out the free SEO course. And inside the SEO system section, I'll include a section on Llama 3.1 plus my best prompts to use on it. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to get a free one-to-one -one strategy session and personalize everything that we've talked about today to you and your business, and we'll show you how we take websites from zero to 145,000 business a month and generate thousands of dollars in sales on autopilot, this free one-to-one -one SEO strategy session will give you a free domination plan. You'll discover the secrets of link building or answer any questions you have. You'll learn the best link building strategies for your website and how to outrank your competitors using link building some of the strategies I've mentioned today. Thanks so much for watching. Appreciate it. Bye-bye.